Okay, when using a mortise machine, this is how you get the key. You get the key gauge. Okay. You put it into what there you go. So this is a three. So you run down the four and it goes in the three. Okay. We've got one out earlier. Goes in three. Right. What we do, we push it in up to the shoulder, make sure it's level. I will loosen it off slightly, then put a key clamp on. And that will make sure it's level as well with the bow of the key. Then again, put the key in. And you start off a bit. <coughs> the bow will keep it level. This machine you can round them off. You can loosen this off. You can do the full. So to work it in its entirety. Okay. Let's start from the top. I'm watching this key so I'm tracing it onto here then this will come together with this so I'm tracing it on this one keep an eye on this but mainly looking at this one This key actually has a bullet wall in here. You can see the channel in there. Now, luckily, this machine caters for that. Okay, why well, I do it? Put it in reverse way. Make sure the key is sitting horizontally. Make sure they're horizontal, otherwise you will go through further. You will just basically cut the blade off. Okay, and what you need to do is loosen this off. Yeah. Give the right size, I think. Just turn the machine off. Loosen this off. See, flat side, another flat side. The rest of it is round. So from there to there. Build up the screw. 
Let's give it a little touch and tightening. Slice this across. Now, the blade cuts this way. I like to go against the blade. If I go with the blade, sometimes it whips across. Okay, so I would like prefer to go against it, so I'm going this way. All right, let's give it a try. Oh, might have turned back on. It's slowly go down. That machine you can see I've got a bullet in there now so what I do is go over and finish the kill and you can see it's a bit one-sided from using this All right let's go over to the uh, vice now okay finishing the kill from the key machine it's giving us this funny slope on one side, if you can see it, just a nice bullet. I just got finished the key off. This is a this is a key horse I've made. Really, I could do with cutting that off there, but that's what I need to do. Thing when doing the key you think about is the welding sometimes that can restrict the key from going in and out of a lock so let's see if I can just make this voice a bit tighter <laughs> so it's always good down the well some people use an emery cloth on this to polish it up or you can just put it on the key machine like the yell type one on the wire brush and just give it a little polish but yeah effectively that's it so that is a copy of that good done cheers